what is the perfect deal structure to get your first deal done? How much should you pay in cash? How much should you put in a seller finance note? How much should you finance through an SBA lender? That's what we're going to talk about. So whereas last year, the best deal you could have offered was a 95-5 structure where 90% of the capital came from the SBA loan, 5% came from seller finance, and their final 5% came from cash. This year, you want to do something different. This year, I recommend you do a 75-15-5-5 offer. 75% comes from the SBA, 15% comes from a seller finance note that you could have the seller get repaid on a 10 year term at about 6%. Another 5% comes from a different seller finance note that's on hold for the life of the first position SBA note. And then last but certainly not least, the last 5% comes in cash. So really what's happened over the last year is you're putting a greater portion of the purchase price in a seller finance note because capital is more expensive than it was this time last year. And last but not least, no, you don't have to raise that that 5% in cash. It doesn't have to be your own cash. You can raise that from an investor. Follow my page to learn more about how to do that.